Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now I hope everyone is doing great and there's a specific reason for why I'm asking you I hope you're doing great because a couple of weeks back Avengers Infinity War released and raise your hand if you feel personally victimized by Thanos. Having said that, can you please address the elephant in the room? And that is how Hulk did not show up through the entire Avengers Infinity War. I mean, except for the beginning of the movie. So I thought, why not bring up the Hulk today here on my channel? Today's makeup look is inspired by the I'm always angry Hulk. So without any further ado, I'm gonna jump right into the video. And all you Avengers fan, you have to stay tuned to see. So first things first, I'm gonna go in with my eye look because you know this eye look obviously involves a lot of green and you can't really risk your foundation while using a green eyeshadow. So therefore I will be doing my eyeshadow first and then the rest of my face. I'm gonna go ahead and set my eyes using the Tarte Shape Tape uh, Concealer in the shade medium. This is what it looks like. I'm pretty sure the ones who are regular on my channel know the drill by now and those who are not, those who are new on my channel. Hi, my name is Kamal and I'm obsessed with Tarte Shape Tape. I'm gonna go ahead and prime my eyelids. Blend it using a damp beauty blender. So guys, now I'm gonna go ahead and set my eyes using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. Okay, it is now time for the eye look and the first palette that I'll be using for this Hulk Glam is the Huda Beauty Electric Obsessions Palette. This is what it looks like. So the first shade that I'm gonna go in with is this bright yellow in the center. I'm going to be using this color in my crease. So I'm just going to take this fluffy unicorn blending brush and dunk into that yellow color. Tap off any excess. And now we're going to go in with this bright orange color right here. And I'm going to again put this color in my crease. I'm just going to go ahead and blend the edges of these two crease colors. So the crease color is on. It is now time for me to bring that Hulk mode on. And the palette that I'll be using for creating that Hulk look on my eyes is this Urban Decay Full Spectrum Palette, which is super colorful, very, very beautiful. I'm really in love with this palette the first time I laid my eyes on it. So stunning. And the first color that I'm going to go in with is called Hatter from the word Mad Hatter. So um, I'll be using this color, this green. I'm just going to grab this blending brush by Morphe and dump my brush into this color. And so this color, although it has a lot of pigment, you need to slowly build it onto your eye and that's exactly what we're going to do. So the green is nice and blended. I'm gonna go ahead and cut my crease using my Dark Shape Tape Concealer. So, wow. so I've cut my crease and while the concealer is still tacky, which means Sticky. I'm gonna go ahead with my fluorescent green color, which is called Meme. Oh, such a nice name for the eyeshadow, which is this fluorescent green color. Pack it in the inner third corner of my lid. Just to get a better payoff, I'm using the same Real Techniques blending brush, the tiny blending brush, tapping off any axis and just patting that color. So as you guys can see, our light green color is here and the dark green is here and there is such a clear demarcation and it's not looking cute. Well, that's where blending comes in handy. So I'm going to take a clean blending brush, just grab that same dark green that I put in my outer corner and just start blending it. So guys, just a tip, the key to this look is to blend because green color is slightly on the difficult side to blend so you just have to keep blending 
till you achieve that right gradient. So guys, this eye is done. Well, not completely done, but almost done. I'm gonna go ahead and repeat the same step on this eye and be right back. So the hulk is on. Now it's time for the foundation. So the foundation is on. I'm gonna quickly go behind the camera, fix my brows, and now I'm gonna go ahead and put that concealer. Okay people, so the foundation and concealer are on. I'm now gonna go ahead and smoke out my lower lash line and I'm gonna take this wide shader brush, grabbing that really dark green. I'm just gonna smoke out my lower lash line. And now I'm gonna take that fluorescent green color and put a little bit of that in my lower lash line. So now I'm going to grab this eye pencil by faces and just apply this black kajal in my upper and lower waterline. So the eyeliner is on. I'm now going to go ahead and bronze up my face using my trusty Hula Bronzer by Benefit. I'm gonna warm up that forehead. And now it is time to contour that face. And I'm gonna contour my face using the Anastasia Classic Contour Powder Kit. I will be using these two cool toned colors onto my face ever so slightly and just contour. I'm now going to go ahead and apply some blush to those cheekbones. So the bronzer is on, the contouring is done, the blush is on. Now it is time for me to apply the mascara and without any guesses, you know the mascara that's coming your way. It's the Maybelline into Gigi Hadid mascara that looks like this. Yes, it's my favorite mascara. Yes, I'm obsessed with it. And yeah, I mean, I just can't stop using it. I cannot put it down. And I'm just gonna go ahead and coat my lashes with this mascara. I'm gonna coat those lower lashes. So we're almost done with this Hulk glam look. I'm gonna go ahead and complete this look. Now technically I know I should be wearing a purple lipstick or something because Hulk wears purple pants. But then I don't have a purple lipstick so we're gonna go in with a red lipstick because Hulk does get angry and red is the color of anger as well if that makes sense. So I'm gonna go ahead with my Fenty Beauty Stana Lip Paint in the shade Uncensored and I'm gonna go ahead and apply it. The lipstick is on. I'm now going to go ahead and apply some highlight onto that face. And the highlight that I'll be using today is by Becca called Champagne Pop. So you guys, this concludes this week's video which was inspired by the one, the only Hulk. I hope you guys like this video. I hope all the Avengers fans especially like this video. In spite of the fact that Hulk disappointed us in Avengers Infinity War, we hope that whichever next Marvel movie comes, Hulk unleashes itself and saves the rest of the universe from Thanos. And on that note, I'm going to end this week's video. I hope you guys liked my take on the Hulk plan. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There's going to be a link somewhere here. If you want to watch my previous video, the link is going to be here somewhere. And I will see you guys next week. Bye-bye.